The Class A title game matched Ann Arbor Pioneer and Redford Catholic Central from Detroit. Redford was jumping for joy to be in the Silverdome. Pioneer was set for some good old-fashioned head knocking. In the first quarter, Redford's Chris Kobath follows some good blocking. He goes 13 yards and a first down for the Shamrocks. On the same drive, Redford's Pete Elizabeth's 37-yard field goal is off to the right, and Pioneer holds its ground. Late in the first quarter now, Pioneer's Adam Hint twists his way downfield. 18 yards and a first down. As the quarter ends, the game is still scoreless. It was a day for the defense. Exhibit A right here, Redford Scott McKee and Eric Knuth stuffed the Pioneer ball carrier. Midway through the second, Pioneer's left footer kicker Chris Moore tries a 35-yard field goal. It's good. Pioneer leads 3 to nothing, and this kick would look bigger as the day goes on. On the last play of the half, Moore tries another field goal, but it's partially blocked by the Redford defense. As the Pioneer band plays at the half, Pioneer leads 3-0. In the third quarter, defense continues to dominate. Pioneers Leonard Cobbs and Brian Bradley stop this play right away. Late in the third quarter, Pioneer quarterback Rob Ferrari hits Cortez Page with a nice pass, 14 yards and a first down. After three quarters, it's still anyone's game. We head now for the final 12 minutes. In the fourth quarter, Redford quarterback Scott Hauncher back to pass. He hits tight end Lou Yeager for 18 yards, and Redford's on the move. But Pioneer holds, gets the ball back, and Aaron Bailey makes a great cut. He goes 43 yards before he's finally tripped up, and the Pioneer fans can smell victory. Two plays later, Bailey breaks four tackles en route to a very important first down for Pioneer. Redford keeps battling back though, but on the final play of the game, Pioneer's Mike Towler makes the sack that ends it. Pioneer hangs on to win the lowest scoring game in state championship history. Redford Catholic Central coach Tom Mock receives the runner-up trophy, and Pioneer coach Chuck Laurie and the Pioneers celebrate the Class A state championship. <laughs>